The answer is 1,927 amino acids. Now, if you had any trouble coming up with this, it's probably because you need to go back and really focus on what gets translated by a ribosome. We know that between the start and stop codons, the ribosome starts reading at the start codon and stops reading at the stop codon. And for this sequence, we have 5,784 nucleotides. So if we actually divide three, right, which is the number of nucleotides in a codon, right, the section that a ribosome reads, and divide that into the total number of nucleotides, we get 1,928. But why do we not get 1927? Remember that 1928 includes the stop codon, but the stop codon doesn't have an amino acid associated with it. The start codon does, right? It has methionine, or MET, MET, or M. But the stop codon doesn't have any amino acid associated with it, so we get 1928 when we divide 5784 by 3. But then we need to subtract 1 because the last codon isn't turned into an amino acid. And so then we're left with 1927 amino acids.